Gilio for NJ Sports Now on this Monday, May the 11th. It took more than three years, but finally yesterday, Michael Pineda ended the debate of the trade that went down early in 2012 between the New York Yankees and the Seattle Mariners. The Yankees shipping Jesus Montero out to Seattle, the power hitting catcher at the time. Brian Cashman, their general manager, called it the most, he was the most impressive and the most polished prospect he ever traded away, calling him one of the most talented players the Yankees ever brought up through their system. Montero was supposed to be a star. The Yankees traded him for a pitcher in Pineda that was also supposed to be a star throughout 2012 and 13, and really heading into 2014, neither became that. Montero struggled out in Seattle. Pineda never could overcome injury problems. Finally, last year, we saw something from Pineda, but he couldn't stay healthy once again, could not get through a full season. And we enter 2015 saying the Yankees probably will win the deal, but we still didn't know. All these years later, there still was no conviction when you wanted to say yes. The Yankees with Pineda won the deal. The Mariners with Montero, who since has had weight issues, has feuded and fought with a coach. There was an ice cream sandwich incident. All crazy things happened happen out in Seattle. But really, until I think the beginning of this season, until Pineda took the mound in the first week of this season through yesterday, there was no conviction to saying, yes, the Yankees definitively won the deal back in 2012. But yesterday, Michael Pineda, he, I think he arrived on the scene nationally. He has been pitching great since the beginning of the season. But yesterday, we can call it his coming out party as a true star and a true candidate, early season at least, for the All-Star game. And I think you project forward here, he looks like a Cy Young caliber pitcher for the Yankees right now. The Yankees are in first place, and we talk a lot about the reasons why from their great bullpen, especially the back end with Miller and Batantis and some timely hitting, some extra power you didn't expect out of a guy like Mark Teixeira, out of an almost 40-year-old A-Rod. But look at the top of their rotation. Without Masahiro Tanaka, they needed someone to step up and be the ace. We all know and can see it with our eyes now. It is not CC Sabathia anymore. It is, though, Michael Pineda. Yesterday in the Bronx against the Orioles, 16 strikeouts, zero walks, Without a shadow of a doubt, one of the best games any Yankee pitcher has ever thrown in the regular season. Absolutely dominant. From the slider to the changeup to the fastball, Pineda was unhittable for most of his outing. He was unhittable for an Orioles lineup that at times can be very powerful and very dangerous. That's how good Pineda was yesterday. And you add those numbers in to what he's been doing the entire season. Now Michael Pineda posts a 54-3, 54-3 strikeout-to-walk ratio. It was an impressive 38-3 to heading into yesterday. When you add 16 strikeouts and no walks, it gets even better. So his strikeout-to-walk ratio is brilliant right now. He's 5-0 on the season with a 2.72 ERA. Very, very good for the New York Yankees ace. If you look at the website Fangraphs, Baseball statistics there, every stat you could hope for. Right now, Michael Pineda, not Clayton Kershaw, not Felix Hernandez, not Max Scherzer, but Michael Pineda is the leader in wins above replacement for starting pitchers. Pineda has been the most valuable starting pitcher in baseball through this juncture of the season. And then you look where he's going here the rest of the season. His numbers and the way he's pitching, get a ton of ground balls and a ton of strikeouts and not walking people, they give you the impression of a pitcher that will be able to keep this up. Maybe not to the effect he did yesterday, but yes, to the effect of being a Cy Young caliber pitcher. When Pineda first arrived on the scene, 2011, a rookie with the Mariners, he looked to be that kind of arm. He looked to be a guy that could be a future All-Star and maybe even push for future Cy Youngs. And then attrition and injury. And years later, it took for him to finally refine that level. And now... He's pitching better than he ever has. He's justifying the faith Brian Cashman had in himself and had in this pitcher to acquire him in 2012. And yesterday, with 16 strikeouts, no walks over the Orioles to help the Yankees win three out of four, he officially closed the chapter on who won the deal, the Yankees or the Mariners. Right now, there is no question. I don't expect there to be one as we move forward here. Pineda is a legitimate all-star. Pineda is a legitimate contender for an American League Cy Young. And Jesus Montero is in AAA. I'm Joe Giglio for NJ Sports.